British Prime Minister Boris Johnson said on Monday, June 14th, the NATO alliance did not want a new Cold War with China. Lithuania told the summit that Russia was trying to swallow Belarus and that the Western military alliance needed to be united in deterring Moscow. North Macedonian Prime Minister Zoran Zev said the summit was a historical moment for his country, the first since it became a full member of the alliance. NATO leaders are expected to brand China a security risk to the Western alliance on Monday, a day after the group of seven rich nations issued a statement on human rights in China and Taiwan that Beijing said slandered its reputation. I think that China is as I've said many times, a gigantic fact in our lives and uh, a new strategic consideration for, for NATO, which after all has spent so much of its time in the last 72 years thinking about uh, the, uh, the Soviet Union, then the, of course the, the, the former Soviet Union, the, the, the various security threats uh, posed from, from that area. But uh, I think when it comes to China, you've got to I don't think anybody around the table today wants to descend into a new Cold War with China. I don't think that's where people are. But I, I think people see, they see, they see challenges. They see uh, things that we have to manage together. But they also see opportunities. And I think that what we need to do is, is do it together. It's a very, very successful alliance. As, as I never tire of telling you, it's the most successful military alliance in, uh, in history. It's done a very good job of protecting the people of this continent. And it's going to continue to do so. This is a historical moment for my country. This is the first NATO summit for North Macedonia as a full member. It is also the first summit for NATO with uh, 30 member countries. This is a great success for both North Macedonia and NATO. NATO membership was a realization of our strategic goal, but furthermore, with our membership, the alliance improved the security and stability for Western Balkans. So what is also very important, that we see the efforts on Bras of Russia to swallow this country, to set it as a platform for further activities of Russia, because uh, Belarus is losing the last elements of the independence. And this is, those tendencies, those trends are very dangerous and we have to be aware of them. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.